Seven lies that all narcissistic people tell. Narcissistic people tend to believe that they are superior and that they are entitled and that they should be able to just get what they want and get away with it. And they pick up on the things that people say and people do to lure people into that false sense of security so that they can manipulate people and they can get their needs met by people. So one of the first lies that a narcissist will come out with is things like, I care about you. I love you. I only want what's best for you. I'm only trying to help you. Narcissistic people simply lack the empathy to genuinely do all of these things. Their actions do not match their words. They're looking to condition you into believing they care about you. Meanwhile, all they're interested in is getting their needs met by you. You misunderstood me is another one. Now, yes, we can all have a breakdown in communication where we misunderstand each other. A narcissist will purposefully go all out to make sure that you misunderstand them and then they will go all out to gaslight you and deflect the blame onto you and accuse you of being in the wrong, that your interpretation of what they said was wrong, that they didn't actually mean it like that, and it's all your fault in some way. I'm the victim here. Narcissistic people love to escape responsibility while gaining that sympathetic attention, so whenever you call them out on anything, they resort to being the victim. Oh, I thought you cared about me. I thought I mattered to you. Wow, you of all people are really saying this about me. You know, I'm only trying my best and that's the thanks I get, is it? So they're going to morph into the victim so that you are too afraid to ever call them out. And if you do call them out, there's going to be hell to play and they'll never do anything for you again while simultaneously blaming you. You're jealous. Not always necessarily a lie as such. However, the part they miss out is how they provoke that jealousy within you. And then instead of having that healthy communication about the situation, they just turn around and accuse you of being jealous. It makes them feel good that you're reacting in that way. It makes them feel special. It makes them feel loved. It makes them feel valued. It makes them feel important and like everybody wants them, even though they've gone all out to provoke jealousy within you. You're too sensitive. Now, no one is ever too sensitive. It depends on the circumstances and the situation and the emotional manipulation they've been under. We are all more than capable of being sensitive. And a narcissist can be some of the most sensitive people you can ever meet. Try offering them a bit of advice and it's not going to go down so well. However, while they're sensitive, they're also extremely insensitive people. So they will purposely provoke your insecurities within you and then when you go to discuss it with them they'll just accuse you of being too sensitive so that they can get away with their behavior whereas other people who are sensitive who can empathize with others don't want to hurt another person's feelings narcissistic people do you'll be nothing without me narcissistic people actually can believe this they believe that they're the bee's knees and the best thing since sliced bread however they use the you'll be nothing without me to place that fear into you so that you don't abandon them until at least they've got a new source of supply lined up so they can be the one who abandons you while they blame you